my god, long time no speak. Oh my gosh, like I've just been super busy. This is my last year of school, so I really, really am sorry guys, but um, I came on here to kind of give you a little bit of an update what I've been loving for the fall so far. I'm not really too much into makeup. I'm mostly into like clothing, hardcore. Um, I also changed my hair, if you guys can't tell. It's been a long time. Oh, I'm just so excited. Um, okay, so yeah, um, shopping haul. I'm not gonna show you guys like what my friends um, got me like gift-wise. I just feel like it's kind of weird. I just went shopping. I just mostly do that for my birthday. I buy usually one thing, like one big thing, but this year I just couldn't find anything that I absolutely love that I wanted to kind of splurge on. So I decided that I was just going to buy a ton of clothes and just kind of overhaul my wardrobe a little bit because my wardrobe has been getting stale and I needed some basics and I just needed definitely a few things so I just decided to do that um, yeah so uh, let me jump into it but really quickly I want to talk about my hair so I went to Bumble and Bumble to get my hair colored my hair was just driving me up the wall and I was like you know what I really want a natural all-over hair color and Ricardo from Bumble and Bumble um, uptown in New York City did my hair and he is amazing you guys if you ever need anyone to color your hair um, he is the guy to do it. Like Bumble and Bumble, they are amazing. They know exactly what they're doing and I could not be happier with my hair. I also got a little bit, I didn't get it cut there, but I went to another place to get it cut and I got bangs. Well, they're not really bangs. They're kind of more of um, like a, a not Sophia Loren. God, who, do, who am I thinking of? Um, brain fart, whatever. So I just wanted like a little bit of a side swoop bang and then just a ton of layers so that my hair is just, can kind of just be like messy and something like that. Like just messy, you know, all over fun. Like that's what I want for my hair. I'm like looking in the mirror, whatever. So um, anyway, I went to Bumble and Bumble and there I picked up some products obviously because while they were styling my hair I was like obsessed with this one thing that this girl was putting in my hair and this is the Bumble and Bumble Thickening Cream Contour so basically what you do it's like a paste and you just put a little bit in your hands warm it up between your fingers and kind of slide it into strands of your hair especially if you have like loose curls kind of like this you just kind of put it into separate curls and it kind of separates and makes your hair more playful, more messy, bouncier. This definitely is amazing. You guys definitely need to try it. Um, so I got the cream contour and then they kept like pushing this on me there. Um, this is the BB Color Minded Sulfate Free Shampoo. It says keeps all tones true. Um, basically, uh, I don't know, I just kind of got suckered into getting um, a shampoo. Mine was running out anyway. And I was like, whatever, color-minded, color-minded. Like, I just kept hearing about that for the first, for the three hours I was sitting there. So I got home and I was just like reading it. And it's literally just like a sulfate-free shampoo. So it's not anything crazy. Like, once my shampoo's done, I'll start using this. But it's not like um, they have some sort of like crazy something in there to like keep your color. It's just sulfate-free. And sulfate-free is what make, it's, is what keeps your color. Blah, 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 blah. So, um, oh my god, I went to Aritzia, you guys. If you guys um, haven't been to Aritzia, uh, to their website, you need to go right now. They are amazing. It's BC, yeah, it's like BCBG and like free people had a baby. Yeah, definitely. It's like, um, it, it has a ton of really cool things, but they're basics. Yeah, this is my huge bag. I went to two. Um, Aritzia's in New York City because there's two. I'm lucky enough to have two here. And um, anyway, whatever. So their style is kind of edgy but more um, plain and wearable. And the fabrics are amazing. Super soft, super great quality. Don't bend, don't like do anything. They just stay the way that they are. And I got this sweater that I'm just like messing around with um, at... Um, Aritzia. This is from Wilfred Free um, from Aritzia and this is the first thing that I got and I love kind of like weird like um, cozy kind of like weird shapeless sweaters and I just really like this. They have like it has a little stud detailing and it just has really great fabric um, that Wilfred Free is known for his like soft and just durable fabric um, and I just kind of like this. I don't know I saw this it has pockets I don't know if you guys can see, but 
Um, yeah, it's just like, it has like a weird kind of hood thing and it just, I love it. So this is the first thing that I got. And I'm going to jump into Aritzia because, um, yeah, it, it's just, it's crazy. It's craziness in here. So, okay, um, the second thing I got was, okay, tags flying all over the place, is this dress, and I love this, this is also from Wilford Free, he's literally the reason why I go with that, to that store, I love him, it's a kind of longer dress, and then in the back it has like a slit, so when you're wearing it, it it's not like a hole, it's like when you're wearing it, you just have like that little bit of a slit and like some skin, it's really cute, you can dress, dress this up, you can dress this down, and um, it's just beautiful and it feels amazing. The fabric, the fabric is really nice. It's like this dark-ish heather gray, and it's kind of nice and long. So um, yeah, <laughs> this is by La Note Noti. Um, it's a gray shirt and it says Paris, Texas, which that was cute. Because <laughs> usually you know it's like Paris, France. I got this in a size uh, extra small, small, but it fits a little bit looser. They didn't have like a, um, a small medium, so I was a little upset about that. And then they had like a medium large, which was humongous. So I just decided to get this one. Um, yeah, Paris, Texas. How cute is that? I love that. You just can kind of like put it on with anything. This one I might be returning because this is a medium and it fits a little big on me. I don't know. Um, this is from Wolfred. And he has two lines he has wolford free and then wolfred just like regular i guess um i don't know the difference between that i guess maybe like one's uh cheaper or i don't know but they're both sold in the same store but look how beautiful this is i love this and it has like uh waffle kind of detailing on the sleeves i i really do love this and then it's a little bit shorter um it's really great quality super soft and it's a little bit shorter in um in the front than it is in the back but it's not anything too severe and it's like just a really nice warm sweater so I love that and uh, it's just this beautiful oatmeal color that I cannot get enough of next thing I got was just random but this is also Wilfred uh, Wilfred free and this is the Decker hat and I just like this I think it's just cute you know what I mean you just um, the whole sporty look is in and you know people wear sneakers people are wearing more baseball hats and I just like this. I think it's really cute, and I like that it's satin because I feel like it dresses up the ba the baseball cap a little bit, gives it a nice kind of cool little edge. So I liked that. I thought that was really cute. Um, got that, and then so Wilford Free. I got this lovely kind of like uh, heather gray in the front, and then black in the back, and then it has um, long sleeves, really super soft uh, crew neck shirt, and it's just. You can just tell the fabric is amazing. And it's a low scoop. Like, I'm just like, I don't know. I, I don't know. I just found a spider in my room, so I'm like, I'm a little jumpy. I, you know? Spiders do that to people. So, it's a, uh, a low scoop neck. It's really, really cute and super flattering. Um, you can just wear this with a pair of jeans just for every day, because I just definitely needed some shirts. So, I decided to focus on that. Then I got another shirt. This is maroon, and this is like a v-neck. It's super pretty. Um, this is by Wolfred. And, oh my god, I'm like freaking out. Sorry. Um, okay, this is by Wolfred. And what's really cool about this shirt is that it has like these two, um, like it has like a panel here. So, do you see what I'm talking about? So, it kind of has like these slits at the sides. And it's long. So, um, you could wear it with jeans or you could wear it with tights. And it's like this sexy little slit, so whenever you reach for something, like, sorry, my camera, like, cut off. So, um, yes. Okay, so I got a jacket from Wilfred, and I absolutely love this. It's like this, sorry, it's like this military style. It's oversized, and it has, like, this really great texture to it. So it creates these, like, cool contours and kind of drapes really well on the body. So I love that. It has, like, this, like, it's just, like, more of a rough material and it's like a true army green I love that it has um, that military style to it as in um, not military the motorcycle style to it so it still has like this cool little collar that you can pop up and this is also from Wilfred Free and um, it has cool little buckle that you can just kind of like adjust or whatever um, and it's like it sits right at your hips it's really beautiful 
so I'm obsessed with this jacket. I think it's awesome. So that's that. And then I got a pair of pants, and I wore these already for my birthday, um, my birthday dinner. And these are from Wilford Free again, and they are like a pleather type material. They are gorgeous, and they feel like pajama pants. They seriously are the most comfortable things ever. And um, I'm just in awe how like soft this like material is and it looks amazing on the body and this just is so much fun and I love that it has the cute little zipper detailing but there's also one pair that doesn't have it so if you guys are like a little iffy on the zippers it's too edgy for you there's definitely just like really plain ones and I love and the ba back just kind of looks like that um, and then I got a skirt with the same type of material I think it's so interesting that they kind of um, made this really super soft material. I'm obsessed with it. This is also from Wilfred. This skirt has a nice stretchy band, so um, you know you can make it like higher, lower, whatever. It's so versatile. I love Wilfred because he kind of like lets you play around with his clothing. It's almost like you can mold it to wh however you want. You know, um, you don't just wear it a certain way. So I love that. So and it's just your basic nice little skirt it definitely needs to be ironed but you know love that so that's the end of my Aritzia kind of like shopping spree I went to Zara I wasn't impressed with uh, Zara's collection for the fall winter I usually love their stuff and I want like everything but this year I just kind of felt like I I don't know I just didn't really like anything so I mean I, ha I got two things that I did like but um it wasn't as impressed as I usually am, which is a bummer, but the first thing I got I love, and where's the tag for this? Uh, where's the tag? Where's the tag? Weird. Okay, um, so this is a, this is a cute little uh, sweater, um, and it says smile and dress well on it, and it has these really pretty flowers, and um, the sleeves are also printed with flowers, and I love this. You can dress this up and definitely dress this down. And it has like a number N or whatever on it. Love, 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 love this. This is so cute. I saw it and I was like, I have to have it in my life. And then I got just a really plain shirt because like I said, I've been really in desperate need of shirts. I just feel like I don't have any shirts. Um, so I bought uh, this. This is kind of cute. I'm not a skater, but... I like it, and it just says skater in New York and has a little dog on it and it has like this uh, f um, faux rolled up sleeve type of thing going on which I really really like on oversized tees I like when it looks like the sleeves have been kind of rolled up um, so that had it and that was a selling point for me um, and then I went to uh, Bloomingdale's and I got these which I absolutely in love with this is uh, wild fox and it says shopping is my cardio on the pant leg and the and these are glow in the dark you guys like are you for real right now I was like I have to have this this is adorable so I don't know if you guys can read this but it just says shopping is my cardio and these are so soft and what I like is that the pant leg the bottoms have like the stretchy um, type of material and they are like a skinny pant so it's not like a true um, pair of like really fat legged uh, sweatpants these are really skinny so they're I feel like they're a little more sleek um, not like sweatpants can be sleek but you know these are definitely more sleek than um, regular sweatpants quote unquote so I love that and then I went to um, Saks and I actually can't show you everything I got um, because I have two things that are like Saks is being is shipping them to me. It's taking forever. Um, I got a Burberry scarf and I just took uh, I just got um, Mark by Mark Jacobs uh, little like slippers like a little loafer type of things um, Fifth Avenue and I hate shopping on Fifth Avenue But I went there to see if I could exchange them, but they don't have I guess Mark by Mark by Mark, by Mark in stores so I stopped by the sunglass counter and um, I remember the Chanel's like I don't know if you guys I remember but I had a pair of black Chanel just regular uh, sunglasses and I have them all over Instagram I lost them um, in the summertime in Vegas well I didn't lose them someone stole them I was in Vegas at, and I was like we were at a pool party and I kind of put them down next to all my other stuff like two feet away and someone I guess saw them and they stole them from me 
So that was like $500 down the drain and I was upset but you know whatever not to because it's just a material item so I wasn't that upset it didn't ruin my Vegas trip but um I had to get new sunglasses because I you know I had none I mean none that I really liked so I got Jimmy Choo's and I love these I saw these and I was like yes so this is what they look like on and they have this really nice kind of gold strip and it's like a dark tortoise shell and it's almost like a way wayfair type wafer wafer I uh, type of sunglasses I don't know how to say that because they have a little bit of that cat eye on them and they're big which is nice because I have a really big face so it's hard to kind of find something that's uh, fits my face I love 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 them oh my god I've been looking for glasses forever and I just felt like I couldn't find any that really fit me and the case is really cute too and um, I went to get some jewelry because um, I'm just not a good like jewelry picker I guess you know like I can't I, I'm just so indecisive that I go into a store and there's just a ton of things and I'm just like oh my god so whatever I don't usually buy jewelry but I felt like I really needed to kind of get into jewelry I don't have a lot of jewelry I don't know where to start so if you guys have any like um brands that you love or you know whatever like let me know please down below um what your favorite brand is or what kind of like jewelry you know that I should check out. Uh, I don't like big costume jewelry. I like kind of dainty understated jewelry like this. Um, and these are two Alex and Ani bracelets and this one has a feather on it. It's so cute and I saw these everywhere so I decided I had to pick them up. And then this one is just a really cute plain one and this has a little locket. Um, like a key in a heart shaped lock and it's just cute and you know whatever you just put them two on and la 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 they're fun I don't know what I just did there um sorry but okay and then the second thing I got were these earrings and I love these got these Swarovski um earrings and I love them this is my second time purchasing them I absolutely adore them so yeah um yeah so I got those because mine were just getting really old and ugly and yes I love you guys thank you so much for watching my camera is about to die I miss you and I hopefully will upload soon Mwah. big kisses bye guys thank you again for watching Mwah. bye